Oh, hello. Hi, how's it going? Well, it's Wednesday. We have made it through half of the week, so it's hump day! Um, yeah, we're gonna be playing Dave the Diver in a second. Uh, my stream deck randomly decided to have an up update right before the stream. Coincidence? I think not. Um, but yeah, we're here. I'm looking forward to having some fun, because that's what we're here for. I saw X-Ray Girl play Star Wars Outlaws earlier, and I asked myself... Uh, I, I, I would say I made the better choice when it comes to uh, when it comes to that, for sure. Um, but yeah, we're here now. Let's see, sources here. For some reason the stream deck's not working at the moment. Hmm. Might have to connect and reconnect it. Dave the Dive is a great game. I love, I love the music already. That's why I uh, want to make sure that you, you look, can listen to this lovely remix I've played uh, playing in the, in the background. Well, for some reason, Stream Deck's still not working. Hmm. That sucks. I just have to manually do it every today. That's okay. Right, anyway. Um... I've been stalling you guys for long, for long enough, so I might as well get to it. Let's get going with Dave the Diver, shall we? Okay. How are y'all doing today? Hope you're doing well. And if, as always, guys, we are here to have fun. Last I checked. All right, new game. Let's see where the camera placement is. Camera placements should be okay. It's just missing some feet. Grizzles! Hey! I'm doing pretty good, my good, my dude. Just relaxing a little. Where's that crap going? Ow. Just need to something real quick. There you go. Let's turn off the monetization for now. There you go. It's hot here. I'm melting. However, today's going to be a good day, I believe. Yeah, it's been... I don't know how many degrees was it today. It's 88 degrees at my end. I'm melting. Literally. Dive the diver. Hmm. We're off to a good start. A boat. I kid you not, this game has been on my to playlist for a very long time. I heard it's a critical darling, so I was always a little bit skeptical when it comes to like games that the critics love. But um, you could almost say it is a fun game. A lot of Koreans worked on it, by the looks of it. Bam! 19 Louisiana with a thousand percent of humidity. Yeah. Yeah, I'm already looking forward to the humidity in uh, fucking America soon. It's gonna be good. Probably gonna melt even more. The thing is, I don't have air conditioning here, so I'm essentially double fucked when it comes to that. But yeah, good to see you guys. Thank you for hanging out with me today. It is hump day. I won't be playing for too awfully long because we got the hump day chin whack later on. But, uh, good news, the Turtles playthrough is a go. So we will be playing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge oh. tomorrow. Oh, Dave, you got here quickly. Well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. So where's the sushi at? <laughs> Don't rush yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like it. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes, which means this could be an incredible business opportunity, mate. Uh, what kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go in. Mm. 
I don't have a good feeling about this. The sushi bar by the blue hole. Prologue. Okay, trim WASD. Okay, well, pretty straightforward. After all, space plan. Gotcha. Whee! Let's go! Longfin Batfish has an extremely wide and flat body with a tiny mouth that contains rows of fins. Nice form. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Uh, how about let's try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. Which left shift you can move quickly. Remember, this is speeds up oxygen consumption. Good. Looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are nimble as a fish freshwater snail. Let's now practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, the dive knife. Try using the survival knife in small fish. You can use the left mouse button. Well done, smooth and quick. And finally, you haven't gotten how to use the forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? The harpoon? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then... Hmm... Hmm, looks like you need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Aim with the right mouse button and then fire with the left. Now try it for yourself. Good start. Ha ha! Abe, how's it going, my dude? Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm melting just a little bit, but that's fine. I'm trying not to like complain too much about it. <laughs> I figured I'd play something chill and nice, so it reminds me of like the cool temperatures that temperatures that we usually have. Okay, now that's now you've got the hang of it. Let's go down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, for sure. That soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh man, that's just the best. Ah, well, listen up. I have a friend who's a sushi chef who who left the business for a while. He's in a bit of a sh he's a bit of a sharp tongue and like a slight temper. But there's one skill that I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one of a kind sushi. The sushi sold here is, is made from fresh fish caught in a blue hole, where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think you will, people will just go nuts for it? Yum, I'm already craving it. <laughs> I bet, so. Why don't you join on uh, this awesome venture as well? What do you say? I mean, I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Hello. Nothing to worry about. The restaurant's already... Uh, you need to, all you need to do is dive and get the ingredients. Hello. Doesn't sound too bad, right? <laughs> so I can eat all, as much sushi, sushi as I want? Hello. Yeah, sure. You have to pay, though. <laughs> Can't wait to check it out. Sushi restaurant next to the blue hole. I was supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Ha ha ha. It's a little bit warm here, you say? And then, uh, hey. Hey, Mancho. Are we ready to open? As you can see, it, it is ready in, in ju just in time. Oh, it, it's already finished. You? Ah, you are the fisherman Cobra was talking about. Well, I'm more of a diver than fisherman. Yeah. All right. Anyway. Anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. So you like sushi? <coughs> so you like sushi, huh? Oh, I, sh I sure do. Tuna, belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy, just thinking about it makes my mouth water. 
Hmm, just as mediocre as I expected. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish, just like you. How empty your life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer. My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone. Well. Hmm, the interior is really quite me quite a mess. Yeah, it looks like we might have to delay the opening today. You know, you, you know what? I spent all money getting this restaurant ready. I have to recover the repair costs through doing business. In this state? <laughs> In the end, it, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Do, did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Hmm. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go and catch seven more fish first. Oh, and the rest of them is going to be open only in the evening. Would that decrease sales? You think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little more money? It's a chef's, it's a chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens a sword on a whetstone. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. Eyo! Hello. <laughs> I believe Highland uh, have been to Refugio around this time of year. The weather was miserable. Seems Bunch was really passionate about his work. He may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. <laughs> I haven't seen Bunch of this enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. Uh, the incident? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have brought that up. Well, anyway... It's we need more ingredients, so go catch seven fish first. 100 gold. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Okay, I've got no guns so far. Okay, that's pretty fun. You can customize my boat. That's that's pretty cool. All right, time to dive. Went with my post to the gun range on Sunday. Split my ass off, but I had a lot of fun. That's that's good. All right, let's go. Let's catch some dories, shall we? Dang it. Okay, the range of that harpoon is not good. Haha! -ha! Gloves, okay, so I can't take that one. Yeah, is this exactly the kind of game I need uh, during the t daytime and the weather we're having? Well, return to the, the ship in a moment. Don't have that much oxygen left. 
Well, thank you for being here, guys, and uh, welcome back to the channel. As always, I've been uh, busy preparing some stuff for my travel. I had to get my train ticket for s Saturday so I don't run into the trouble of ha ha having a busted ticket machine. Encountering me. I don't freaking need that. Oh, I have a maximum. Oh, I just realized actually I have a limit to what, how much I can take. <laughs> Wood. Yeah, let's get out because I'm running out of oxygen. Yes, return to boat, please. Thank you. What are the th chances? Fancy meeting you here. Yeah, I, I watched X-Ray Girl play Star Wars Outlaws earlier, and I was like, yeah, no. I need to uh, reward myself with something good. All right, looks like you caught quite a few. At this rate, we make boatloads of money in no time. <laughs> my, my, would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry up and get this things ready. Why don't you head to the sushi bar? Prepare sushi ingredients. 12. Ooh. I would kill for 21 degrees Celsius, to be honest. Wrap up your day and get things ready to banjo sushi. By the way, only you'll only be able to die for once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner starts. Dinner hour starts. Stars Outlaws is ridiculously bad. I have no idea how they greenlit that game. But yeah. How were the preparations coming along? I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here's a here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're here to help me run the sushi bar from today onwards. What? Uh, I, I don't understand. Cobra told me that there would be somebody to help with the ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do is cook. And who else is there for that but you? Wait, I've never worked as, at a restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll give you a quick primer, so pay attention. What? Open the ingredients below. Here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all other materials you have. For now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. Look! Uh, it's like th it's like 30 degrees here, Abe. Alright, now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. New recipes need to be added to the menu before they can be sold to customers. There's a sushi recipe from the fish, fish you acquired earlier. Try registering that to the menu. Norimaki. That probably wasn't that hard. Sending ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Let me repeat it. One food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you'll have to replace items on the menu to refill the ingredients. You can also enhance the flavor of the dishes to try it out when you have enough ingredients. For now, use the ingredients that you caught to fill out the menu as much as you can. Yes, auto supply. Are you going to stand there talking? Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Green tea before. Uh, oh no, only soft drinks, I think. Yep, 30 degrees, mate. 33 even. Pour over a green cup of green tea. Mm. How do I go to the menu? Mm. 
somehow I cannot click anything. Sucks. I think the game's stuck. Wait. Can't save right now. What? Why not? It won't let me click anything though. Huh. Ah, okay. I have to walk to him. Press S to pull green to you just the right amount. Okay. Because customers who drink green tea of a good or higher grade will pay more. Okay. As expected, a bunch of green tea is quite something. Mm. Let's see what I've got my appetite going. Is this something to eat, perhaps? <laughs> Demanding as always. Why don't you try serving him some food while you're at it? <laughs> come, here, oh, come over to where I am and take this food. in the package last week, did you say? What in the world? Let me check on that. Cobra didn't eat. He always, he's always distracted like that. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. Seems like such a waste to throw it away. Bancho Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Well, alright. Everything looks about ready. Hmm. I haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kind of nervous. Don't forget to press EF to fill in the menu for business to begin. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's get ready. Getting people into your art store. Oh, that's a good thing. Pretty fun. Oh, Dave, you collected 100 gold. Great job. This should be enough to repair what's broken. <laughs> then give me some time. These repairs will need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming. E Easy enough. Bench of sushi closed for the day. 104 net profit. You earned 5 artesian flames. Nice. We're doing good, folks. We're doing good.
We saved the restaurant. Phew. Works finally done for the day. My legs and back hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but you well, not bad for the first day. Try a little harder next time. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. <laughs> a man should not feel gratification from simple compliments. Yeah, yeah, all right. In any case, a toast to the opening of Bancho Sushi. Cheers to that. You saw that trash and you dove right into it. Release the Kraken! Boy, that is not a good thing. That escalated a little too quick. <laughs> Ellie's calling. All right. Hmm. I, you, are you the man who's been diving around here? Yeah, yeah I think so. I was expecting a more professional-looking guy. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the local graduate school. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I'd like to study the ecology of this blue hole. Give me some agar and a red starfish first. I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one each, so give me two of each. Your tone. Makes me want to refuse. Hmm. I've got a reward, but... If you don't want it, that's fine by me. <gasps> a reward? Well, I wasn't refusing. I'm just I was just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry. Don't dally. Mm, fair enough. New content. Smartphone. You can use your phone to access various types of content. Check your current missions and more. Game settings can be accessed from the phone. Come to think of it, it's already been around eight years that we've known each other. I was having fun back then, yeah. back then when Richelieu Rock. You suddenly wanted to get your suitcase that fell off the boat. <laughs> I thought you. I was in real trouble back then. I was looking at, at, at what kind of a weapon stealer, and there were, were important blueprints in that suitcase. Luckily, you saved them before they could be ruined. I have no idea how uh, oh, I would have thought Hans Lindemann without the blueprints. Hans Lindemann? I was talking to myself, don't mind me. Alright. Don't mind me then. Off we go! Diving ain't easy, mate. If you die in the water, you'll only be able to retrieve a single item. <laughs> Oh, that sucks. There's some agar over here. That's the item. That's, that's the starfish that I need. I need, I need gloves for that one. I gotta say, this game is pretty relaxing. <laughs> Compared to like the stuff I usually play. I love the music too, it's like this synth wave kinda kinda stuff. And the jellyfish was doing pretty well, so I might as well get some more. Normally, 
Normally I'm not like the fan of these micromanaging games, but yeah, it is kind of fun. Copper ore. Ooh. Ow. Yeah, I should make myself too heavy, otherwise I can't swim up again. Tajime. Escape pod. Nice. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first as the calling pr process takes some time. Ooh. There's oat. Oh, there's oxygen down there. I actually grab that real quick. Ooh, okay, so that makes dice a little bit easier. <laughs> I've got a baseball bat as a melee weapon, that's funny. Seriously, guys, this game is very relaxing. I love it. I'm kind of glad I bought this on the Nintendo Switch as well, because I'm going to be playing that while I'm traveling. A harpoon! A shock bank stick! Ooh. Yes. Actually, let me just get the bank stick, because I think that will be more worth it. Take this. Yeah, okay. More oxygen. Okay, if, if you exceed your weight limit, you will slow down. If you exceed an even higher amount, you won't be able to carry any more. Okay. Probably have to get rid of some things. Okay, it's 10.3. So I can't take too much copper ore with me, unfortunately. Although the jellyfish is very heavy, so... Nah, just have to get rid of some copper ore. Shamash! At work, but I hope you're having a good day. Thank you, I do. 9.9 kilograms. Still too heavy, but I'll make it work. Somehow. Uh, da, 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 da. Can I pick multiple? That would be good. Oh, yeah, I can actually. Uh, 9.1, that's fine. Get off the ch jellyfish tentacle. Or the wood, maybe? Yeah, let's get rid of the wood. Although I probably need that for the. Nah, I'll discard this. Okay, um, get this agar here. How's my nine kilograms? Oh, there's a mm, what's this? Soy sauce. So the shocking stick is actually doing some decent damage to the fish. Oh, 11 kilograms. Oh, they ain't good. Should probably head towards the surface. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, guys, this game is very, <laughs> very good. Uh, you know, so, sometimes I'm very skeptical when uh, 
Games become critical darlings for no fucking reason. This game is, is quite fun. Carlo for the RNG podcast. I should recommend this game to me too. Right, if you die in the water, you'll only be able to retrieve a single item. Hmm, you actually bought in the back. Hmm, I guess I expected a little too little of you. Alright, this should do for now. I'll give you a reward as promised. Since you helped me do my research. The sudden, the sudden ecological changes in this region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue to need your services. I have my number. 70 gold, 5 olive oil. Oh, Jack Tyler will be happy about that. And 5 soy sauce. Nice! Look at that. Dive, did you loosen, loosen up yesterday? Did you get to loosen up yesterday? Hmm, mm, I saw a lot of nasty fish. It won't be easy to go any deeper. Hmm, I did notice that the fish in the blue hole have an odd violent streak. Perhaps something puts them on itch. Speaking of which, why don't you take a gun in addition to the harpoon? Yeah, every now and then the hive is actually deserved. I agree. A gun? I have a friend who's knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you to him. Duff! Wow, Cobra, it's been a while. Who's the goofy looking guy next to you? Uh, sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger. I'm Dave, a professional diver. Interesting. Uh, I thought divers were athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. Uh, look at you, dude. People who live in the glass house. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> what? So what's this about? I'd like you to get straight to the point. I've begun a very interesting business. <laughs> and now I'm in need of some weapons. Duff, I need your help. Hmm, season 2 of Stra Stella has just ended anyway, so I'll give you a listen. Alright, I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. The terrain and ecology inside, it changes every time you go inside. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when brought out. I'd like you to make a weapon that can be used inside. Yeah. That's rather interesting. You've piqued my interest. As a weapon researcher, you could say... My hypothesis is that anything that's not made from materials found in the blue hole will continue to break down. This will be especially true to, uh, of guns, which have precision parts. Hmm. So we, we'll have to get the materials from the sea ourselves. <laughs> Dave, you'll have to prove yourself as a diver to this, to this master Duff. I'm not sure why I should have proof, to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think one rope and one scrap iron. You heard him right, Dave. Enter the blue hole and bring back rope and scrap iron. By the way, if you run out of oxygen midway, you'll only be able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. Phone charm. Come to think of it, it's already been around eight years. Yeah. Okay, we, we know this already. Alright. Let's keep diving, folks. Black and white snapper. An aggressive carnivore with black eyes and fins. There's treasure down here. Take that. Okay, that's interesting. Ah. 
Ah, Mediterranean parrotfish. I may have wasted too much oxygen just on that. I think I've found one of the parts. So scrap iron is here, that's good. I would imagine the rope would be a bit little further below. Oh, there's the rope. Might as well get some more ingredients while I'm here. Sometimes the hype can be warranted, but like I said, sometimes I'm getting very skeptical when game journalists are hyping up a game. Especially uh, when it comes to like certain mainstream games that I have at the moment. Particularly uh, from the Star Wars kind. Yep, same with movies. That's true. That is very true, my friend. I think I just about make it up back to the surface if I keep it going like this. Yep, return to boat, please. If you go deeper than your current equipment allows, your oxygen will flash red and will deplete quickly. Be careful. Hello. Well, to think you actually managed to bring it back. I expected you quite the expire in the depths, you could say. Mm. Seems I have underestimated you slightly. Very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. First of all, download Duff's weapon shop on your phone. It's well optimized, only 42 megabytes, you could say. You collect all the materials. Good. Let's try and create a weapon. Ha ha. Basic on a water rifle. We interrupt anime to bring you Dave okay. the Diver. <clears throat> With a neat explanation like that, even someone like you could have understood. Just could have understood. Well, I guess. Oh, and one more thing. I've taken some measures to allow you to open weapon chests on the water. Whoa! Weapon chests? You can bring them out uh, off the sea. But they can still come in handy, you could say. But I'll collect info about the weapons you pick up and create blueprints for you. Weapons made with a blueprint won't break down on the water, you could say. In any case, this master will be watching you. Goodbye, eternity. <laughs> Undersea gunslinger completed the gun tutorial. Oh, nice. You can craft weapons at Duff's weapon shop. Acquiring a weapon, a uh, certain material, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Hmm. Wrap up your day and get things ready to buy your sushi. Investing in researching ingredients, food, a bunch of sushi bar will become more and more popular. Mm -hmm. Let's in enhance some ingredients. The terror. <laughs> the terror. Nice.
Alright, let's open up the, the restaurant. Open! I love this little micromanaging uh, management thing that's going on. Close for the day. Nice. Five artesian flames. Probably shouldn't have enhanced the ingredient. Maybe I would have gotten kind of more of a profit. Are you Dave by chance? No. Yes, what is this, sir? Wow, I'm always right about these things. Haha. <laughs> nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the Sea People civilization. No. The Sea People civilization? Haha! <laughs> I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky? I have an expert like me to tell you all about them. No. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have asked. The Sea People civilization lies in legends. They're said to have occupied quite a bit. They worshipped fish and have gills allowing them to breathe on the water. They lived in the depths allowing them to flourish without any concern for invasion of other civilizations. But sudden changes to the sea bottom brought about their abrupt downfall. That's about all there is to the story. Everybody thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course. But proof that they have been real was found right in the vicinity of this place. Huh? This is an amazing find, one that could turn the whole academic world upside down. <laughs> an ancient civilization under the sea. You'd only see such things in comic books or games. What makes you say they were real? My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that it is from no known civilization. It is dated around 1,500 years ago as well. There were no civilization in these parts back then. Hmm, that is interesting. But what business do you have with me? Well, you see, my assistant's, crypto, assistant's cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out and he won't be around for a good while. That's why I'd like you to, to help me. Oh. My assistant told me that the, that the artifact was found 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. We're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can... <laughs> ha! Sorry to interrupt with the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dive. Of course we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Yaha! Yeah. What? Uh, we don't have time to swim around searching for artifacts. Think about it. If an underwater civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. A bunch of sushi will be bursting at the seams! Mm. Mm, I suppose you have a point. <laughs> Alright, I help. Ha, <laughs> isn't that lucky? Of course, I won't be asking you, of, uh, you to f f work for free. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're wearing for free. Whoa! With an enhanced diving suit, you'll be able to venture deeper. This is essential for exploration. These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Technological advancements are amazing, eh? Let's first install the iDiver app on your phone before we proceed. iDiver. The iDiver app allows you to enhance various diving equipment. Uh, upgrade equipment with the money you make at the sushi bar and elsewhere to explore deeper waters. 
Sounds like fun. Do -do. There's no net rotting Nuno today, folks. I just got a message. Now then, let me tell you how to use the iDiver. I'll install the app for you so you unlock your phone first. iDiver. Operate the diving suit for free. I'll take, definitely take the. Alright. Good. Now you'll be able to venture a bit deeper. Once you have enough money, uh, use the eye diver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suit as well as your cargo box and oxygen tank. Never forget that anything can happen in the deep waters. I'll be in touch! Alright. Okie dokie. Traces of the sea people. Mid first equipment upgrade. Better equipment. Nice. Can I do anything else since I have the money? Probably take the air tank. Yep. Also the cargo box, so I can actually carry a little bit more. Always a good thing. Okay. More things means more money. Come to think of it. Uh, blah, 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 okay. Alright, okay. Let's go and dive. Yep, I get to keep playing this, so that's good. I'll play probably until 8 o'clock, so I have one hour to prep myself for home day chin wag. I'm actually quite happy that I can play a little bit more now. This game is so relaxing, folks. Like, seriously, if you need a game that's very simple to play, that's this loop of, like, deep sea exploration and just simple things like this. Go for it. It's, it is really good. Ha poison harpoon tip. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, but apparently I have to. I think I just poisoned the fish. Okay, I shouldn't poison the fish because that actually ruins it. I think. Okay, you can actually shoot things with the gun. Okay, that's good to know. 15 damage! What the? That's insane, dude! It's like 55 stabs. For my knife. Oxygen capsule. Nice. <laughs> Bit overkill to shoot the fish with that, but sure. What we got here? Ammo, huh? Straightforward, I actually like like that when games are not this overly complicated. I'm halfway with my load of carriage, so I have to be a bit more careful. Maybe get, gather some more fish. Oh. Fuck you, fish. Twenty fish with melee weapons. Nice. Turmeric! Good thing I got the excess oxygen tank.
Uh, let me know if you guys want to see more of this game. I'll uh, make sure to uh, do so. Play, play some more. Maybe record some. Good to know that there's a, another chest here. Remember folks, there's always hump day chin wax on later on. On my channel and Tommy's channel. get these ingredients up so I have them here. When your oxygen turns orange, you're approaching the limits of your capacity. <clears throat> Hush start. Hello. Dave, while you are set to see the repairs were completed, Hello. let's head to the restaurant. Investing in and researching. Whoa, it's looking very nice. Ah, doesn't it matter how delicious the food is? The restaurant can't be a mess. Oh, if you want to change the interior, the interior menu b below is open, so please check it. You know, freely change the interior of Bancho's sushi. Use the interior tab to select the staff you're liking. Uh, but uh, so Dr. Bacon said this it, if the remains of the sea people are found here, customers will indeed come, but this area is kind of remote, so I think we I will need, uh, need to advertise the store until then. Mm. Yeah, these days it's just about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Mm. Ah, have you tried the social media app na named Cookster? Mm. You mean the social media app young people use to post pictures of the food they eat? Mm. Yeah, it's so about. Uh, how about. That's how all businesses are promoting themselves lately. I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographs. Mm. Mm, even so, isn't it better to use it than to keep people ignorant of your food, Bancho? Mm, you have a point there. I'm uh, making an account of simple. Make an account of simple, so let's try it out. So if you first register, make a hashtag Bancho Sushi, then done. Oh, if it's not that complicated as I expected. Mm. Our customers happy with your food will follow Bancho Sushi. I hmm. I'm not sure about this, but okay, I got it. I also installed the Cookster app on my phone and check the followers' posts. And yeah, the music is pretty good for this game. I really love it. Raise your rating in Cookster. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlock conditions of the new ratings can be seen in the Cookster app. Let's see the interior.
The music's absolutely perfect for this game, Sekai Among Us. I agree. I love these little animations that they sprinkle in between. <laughs> Behold! Sushi. Preparations go well. Got to, got to get the menus ready before opening hours. Bunch of sushi by grand opening. You've never tasted sushi like this before. Reasonable prices and great service. Open only in the evenings. game just to be on the safe side. Just gonna get some more ingredients. More money for me. You'll be able to increase your social media rating if you get more followers. You'll unlock more features at a higher rating. That's good to know. A dolphin! It's Echo the Dolphin, folks! It's Echo the Dolphin! Huh? A dolphin? Hmm. Seems to be asking me to follow. Should I try and follow? What if that dolphin's trying to get me killed? Scooter. Mm. Dolphin. 
they left me with a pearl, it seems. Gift. Hmm. I didn't know dolphins had mates, he says. A pearl. That isn't good. I'm running out of here. Okay. We're using Artesian's flame to research new dishes. Mm. Feel stiff, even so, Bench is working alone, so she probably help. It's not easy to manage with two people, with more customers coming in. Blue sushi is the blues. The color of the sea tasted good too. Bench of sushi. So you take a profile picture? It's hard. <laughs> Sushi in the moonlight is twice as good. Look at all these foodie posts. Unapologetically Asian, I love it. Hmm. Basic underwater rifle. I probably should sell the pearl and see what, what it gives me. Traces of the sea people. Special guests may visit the bar. Oh, the food critic. Mm -hmm. This is Banjo's sushi place, huh? <gasps> Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cookstar. The name gave me pause, but I think it's really your place. New food and using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A tacky, tacky turn of masculine, but masculine chef. Oh, did they mention me too? No, not really. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, it's nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day with training myself. My goodness, that is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion. And this is what got you booted from the hotel. 
I'm talking about that again. That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. How long will you continue treating customers that way? To keep making that terrible food. We mean terrible. Whole roasted shark head is ex an excellent dish. Shark has been used in cuisine in both West and East. And in Korea, it is was even used in ancestral rituals. Stop, you're not changing one bit. Let me judge for myself then. Whether the food's fit for your consumption. Then I can tell you why I came. Find it. I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the t true taste of shark head meat. Rancho, isn't this development a bit sudden? Dave, as a chef, it, this is a fight I can't back out of. My pride hangs on in the balance. Please get me the white tip reef shark head in olive oil. I want to catch a white tip reef shark? Yes, with your skills, it should be easy enough to do. But a harpoon's not likely to be enough. You can take a gun with you into battle. Even if some fighting shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say that you just stand by and watch while my pride is trampled? The white tip reef sharks are usually found in the ocean far from to the right. Good luck. Suddenly wants me to get him a shark head? This is preposterous. And it can only be killed with a gun? I have to ask Duff to make me a gun. Or research for one in the blue hole. Special customer. So there's special customers with a backstory over here and here of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and research reserve them and food and serve them to the customers. Yes. Perfect busy. So grab the shark then. Can't dive during the evening. Well, that sucks. Well, I guess I have to do that another time then.
Nice. 99 bucks. Yes. Nine bucks bonus. Just have to get some shark next time. That's what I'm gonna hunt for today. I'm gonna hunt for some shark. Hope I took a gun with me this time. Yeah, it did. Okay, good. I love how chill this game is, guys. This is so freaking good. Baseball bat is always a good idea. How you doing, by the way, Grizzle? You good? You good, sir? Shit. Well, that didn't work. You're mine! Aha! Got a good amount of fish. It's good. Whew. Swim here so I can grab this scrap right here. That eel always reminds me of Mario 64. Whenever I see it. Oh, a triple axle. Nice. It's actually a pretty good rifle. I could kill the shark with ease with that one. And a underwater scooter. Oh my god, game, you're blessing me right now. I don't even know how to deserve that. Bugger off, mate. Uh, non lethal trank gun. Hmm. Oh, wait, so I can only pick one gun. Okay, that's good to know. So it's one harpoon and one gun. Okay, good to know. I think I've got that scooter. Definitely need a I have cooked the dog. Then I had some dinner. Something like that. Okay, there you are. Come here, fucker. Aha! Shit. Okay, I didn't expect the shark to hurt me that badly. Oh, 
shit. Oh, I'm cutting it very fucking close. Okay, the shotgun is definitely not the way to go for this one. So de definitely need to take a pistol. Let's see if I can have enough ammo left. Okay, the hush dot is complete. That's good. And I got quite a bit of fish. That's good. Let me see if I can update the suit. Who's this, who's this Ash Ketchum looking motherfucker? Yo! Hoppity hop! Yo! You, you know a lot about this giant blue hole. Well, I'm not sure what to say to that. It's a different every than there every time. Yes, that's it. It's the best place to click Marine CA. Hmm. I could complete my collection in this place. Aha! Marines, Marine car? Wait, don't tell me you don't know about the highly popular Ocean Life trading cards Marinka. Hmm. How can you not have heard of the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to the fish in real life? Uh, never heard of them. It sounds fun though. <sighs> you seem quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. You do this, then press here, touch that, add a friend. Done. Uh, okay, so what do I do now? The amazing thing about Marinka is... You don't really, don't really need to do anything special. Just catch a few fish, you get a card, check the cards every now and then on the app, and you're done. I see. I guess I'll be able to easily see what I've caught so far. That's right. It's almost like a... Whoa, you don't want to be saying the name. I understand. I'll try it out. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Sato. I'll give you my contact info. Send me up if you have a quest you have questions. See you then. Choo-choo. Choo-choo, he says. Like a fucking train. Alright, let's see if I die where. Wait, that's good. 19 kilograms to carry? Yes. See what cooks does. Sushi is perfect light meal after a workout. Sushi is nice. I don't like the strange guy serving it though. Pretty fun. Okay, let's go. I eat more. Did you use a shock harpoon on uh, on, on on those doctor fishes? But eh. we'll have to do. guys been up to today though chat anything exciting try not to melt 
Tell me. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Basic underwater rifle, I think. It's a bit easier to aim. That fish learned the basic concept of fuck around and find out, it seems. Holy fuck, that's a big boy. That's a big chungus right there. came in clutch. That came in pretty clutch right now. I was working the next restarted just after I got back. Yeah. She's still going by the way. She's still playing. I could never put myself through playing that fucking Star Wars game. Like seriously. There's no way in hell I would play that. That's good to know there's a Escape pod here. Glass. Okay. Whoa! box ah. I'm gonna die am I I'm going to die because this keeps up no For fuck's sake stop yeah I'm gonna drown if this continues I have to grab this fucking scooter Dude, I was... Yeah, that game was trolling. Yeah. One oxygen I had left. Steadily making the right upgrades will be the keys to preventing your sudden demise. That is true. It does. Hundred fifty centimeters fish. That's like ninety percent of my height. Oof. Well, that fish is gonna give me some good money, though. Hmm. Yep. Let's get the fuck out of here and make some money. One oxygen point left until I have the resuscitation tank there. That would have been very awkward if I would have died there.
He's a better samurai than Yasuke. Think about it. Some money folks let's go let's fucking go i wonder what happens if you run too fast does that mean you will tip over and, <laughs> and drop the ingredients on the floor curious about that I think I'm pacing my f running a little bit because it would be slightly awkward otherwise. was not patient enough. It seems. Can actually hire stuff now? Ooh. That's good. It was smooth, love this game. It's so good the further along you go. But nothing actually this game is pretty fun, I'm not gonna lie. It's not good. Mm -hmm. Pretty good, not gonna lie. A lot of fun. Raining. Hmm. I'll check cooks there real quick. Headshots like this are the trend now. Hmm. An award. Oh, we have received an award. That's nice. for a dive. Let's go! I need to pace myself with the oxygen waste as well and remember to dodge attacks because of that takes a toll on my oxygen too. <coughs> oh, another dolphin! I won't spoil anything but if you think it's fun now just wait until a few hours in. Oh I bet! This is like a really massive fucking time sink isn't it? <laughs> I, I bet it is. Huh? You must be the dolphin from before. Why? Does it look like you're in a hurry? I wonder if something's going on. Come to think of it, I don't see the pink dolphin this time. I should follow. Yeah, 
Yeah, you lead the way, Mr. Dolphin. You know, I unironically want the developers of Dave the Diver to make a Echo the Dolphin game. I haven't seen played an Echo of the Dolphin game in years. Oh, the pink dolphin. Pirates must have captured it illegally. <laughs> should quickly cut its net. Yes, you should. Wait, they're shooting at me? The fuck? Okay. It's a bit gay, isn't it? Thank goodness. I kind of like the art style for this game. It's like, not like retro looking, but also not like too, too crazy uh, retro, you know? Gold bar. Okay, interesting. I can see why people like this game. It's uh, it seems to be like a massive time sink in a way, but at the same time, it seems to be very fun to play. I like the gameplay loop of it so far. fill up my oxygen real quick, even though I've got plenty, but just want to make sure that I have enough. Excuse you, where do you think you're going? Get back here! Aggressively Battering the uh, space bar right there. Let's see what we got here. Enhanced harpoon tip. Ooh. It does ooh, it does seven damage this, this time. That's pretty good. I like that. Straight girls would play this psychotic mongoose. What do you think? Kind of want her to play this. It's probably more rewarding than fucking Star Wars, <laughs> to be honest with you. Lightning harpoon. Careful, I'm not wasting my oxygen for nothing. Okay. Let's dive up a little bit here. Oh, 
Oh, yes. Very good. I love that. Da -da. I think Steph has played this, no? Oh, shit. That's convenient. There's an escape pod here. Please be oxygen. Please be oxygen. Yes! Hi! No! Oh, that was close. F you, big fish. F you. I mean, I've gifted this game to Mark, and Mark actually liked it, so she does have... She could hypothetically play it, considering they're sharing their Steam library together. <laughs> I love how I'm shooting, like, random fish in the water, and they just... become part of my inventory. There's the... Trying to fuck around, trying to. Oh, shit. That's a good thing is there's an escape pod right near me. How much health does this fucker have? Like seriously. Oh no 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 no! Don't risk it, smooth. Don't risk it. Ah! I need to go. Oh. Brandon! Hey, how's it going, my dude? Did watch Stiff play Thank Goodness You're Here and I think that would be a fun game for extra too. What is that game about? I've seen it, but... Uh, I've seen the name of it, but... I've never really gotten into it. Also, is there a way to sell gold in this? The gold? It's very British and hilarious. Okay. <laughs> you have my attention, sir. <laughs> Workshop later too. Hmm. Okay. Oh, let's go back down there and see what the fuck's going on. Barrel jellyfish. A large cylindrical jellyfish shaped like a giant mushroom or bell. Eight tentacles. Right, okay, let's have a look see. We need more. Ingredients. <clears throat> Excuse me. Need to keep an eye on the channel a little bit. Good. So now there's an oxygen tank here. Let's see what the gun box has it for in store for us. A poison harpoon. Nice. Actually swim a little quicker. There you go. I think Nomi would like this game too. I might actually suggest you place this. Wait, can you believe it guys? They're killing off these the support for Animal Crossing relatively soon. And I'm pretty shocked that they did. Because that game was the Nintendo's golden goose for a while, especially during COVID.
Yeah, that's Nintendo for you, though. Sometimes they just kill off uh, certain things they have uh, success with. Nobody truly understands it, but that's just how it is, unfortunately. That's the sad truth of digital distribution in general. I mean, you can still play it, but they won't uh, upgrade it anymore. That's one. That's what I heard. A bit questionable decision, but... Mm. That's just the time and age we live in nowadays. We can be considered lucky that we actually got so much content for the game. Hush start. Ow. Okay, there's an escape pod here, that's good to know. Good. On a water scooter is always good, especially if I need to escape later on. See if I can get the shark this time. Now the poison dart will do jack, sh jack shit against him, that's, that's for sure. I love the fact that you have a cooldown on the gun though. Not exactly the best design choice, but okay. This point is this fucker app, like seriously. Okay, I'm out of bullets, that's not good. Let's just hope he doesn't heal or something. I mean imagine having a shark having a healing factor, that'd be hilarious. Yeah, I'm not a massive fan of digital distribution in general, but I, I'm saying that and I'm playing this game right now, which it doesn't have a physical release. I killed the shark! Yes! Oh boy. Oh my god, 2.5 kilograms, that's insane, especially on the water. It probably weighs a fucking ton. Underwater. I got the fucking shark. Nice. That's, I'm okay with that, by the way. <laughs> right, let's see if I can find anything else while I'm swimming down here. Oh! It's actually. Ugh. He gooped all over my screen! How dare he! I need to uh, stock up with some oxygen though. It's always a little awkward not seeing enemies health as you don't know how well you're doing. Yeah! Apparently I'm too- it's too heavy. No. I need to get rid of some shit. I don't want to get the, rid of the Barracuda. Heck no. Can get rid of the line. Fish thorn though. Yeah, let's discard that shit. Right, okay. Apparently, uh, oxygen is still working. Okay. There's, oh, there's the item that we're looking for. Down here, I see it now. Let's grab it. Oh, I think that's one. Come back to the boat safely. I'll be waiting. Uh, excuse me? They believe when they're close to death. So it's terrible to saying that. I mean, you ain't wrong. Holy fuck, was that what I thought it was? Yeah, I agree, Dave. We need to get the fuck out of here. Oh god, do I really need to discuss some shit? 
Mm. What do I get rid of? Triggerfish, maybe? And some... Yeah, the triggerfish. Okay. Now I just need to find a... Reasonable pace to swim. Yeah, it's definitely time to leave. I don't think that fish took quite a like a whatever that was. I think it was an octopus, right? Didn't like the fact that I was rummaging around down here. Okay, thank God there's an escape pod because I need to get the fuck out of here. I will do. I will make some profit though because there's a lot of things that I've seen down there. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. <laughs> All right, you brought it out safely. It seems to be in very good condition, almost as if it was stored somewhere until recently. Hmm, very interesting. This may be the find of the century, even. Oh, Alright, yeah. Dave, let's continue to work together and uncover the secrets of the Sea People civilization. <laughs> what? I thought I'd only be helping you once. <laughs> <laughs> of course, say no more. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Oh, yeah. That won't be too hard to do. Yeah, I've got very few feet. A lucky feeling about this. I'll be in touch. Three hundred gold. What the? Guys, I can upgrade the restaurant with that. Right, let's wrap it up and head to the restaurant. Traces of sea people. Ingredients are used to enhance stuff. Let me check the interior real quick since I've got 400 now. Lightwood. Yeah, it's definitely. I don't know. Actually, let's take the brick interior. Yeah. Chairs. Actually, no, let me let me save some money first because I don't want to waste it all on just the interior now. These little animation flourishes, they were so good. Let's, let's get all these dishes in so I have some bit more variety. There you go. Five new dishes researched. Nice. Is there a way to actually improve Dave's stamina when he's running? Because that would be cool. I mean, I could get myself a better oxygen tank, but I'm not gonna waste it on on that now. <laughs> a little foam charm, love it. All right, let's check the menu. Let's go. Oh, you can actually serve five dishes now. Dishes the better. Mm, let's take, yeah, let's take that one. I 
me just check something in the cookster wrap real quick. If there's anything. No. Okay. All right. Ready, folks? We have to have a match. Restaurant to match. Let's go. There she is. Let's serve some tea for this lovely lady right here. <laughs> Need to run this uh dishes are running. What is happening? <laughs> How do you like it? It's good. It's tasty. I can taste the wet. It's wet to reef shark fatness at the crispy whole roast, but it's not an overly cloying flavor. Is this ginger? The ginger scent mixes with the strong flavor of the head. It's quite lovely. <coughs> Pardon me. I wasn't expecting this to be good. The book of the Five Rings states that oh, oh, one should oh, look at the essence of something instead of its appearance. <laughs> Sharks look terrible on the outside, but they have robust meat in their head. It's a delicious taste. Whole roasted shark head brings such traits to, to a maximum potential. I must admit, this is good. You pass, Pancho. Let me tell you why I'm here then. This restaurant needs to hire people. I can help you with that. No? What do you mean? You still mean to go go to, to call it alone, Bancho? This place is already operating at full capacity. This might be okay for you for now, but now you won't be able to cope when there's more customers coming. I can't continue working alone, but it's not easy to find people I can trust. It's Yoshi the recruiter. This is what I do these days. I'll start by putting out a hiring ad. Nice. So that means I can actually hire people now. Okay. Let me tell you to recruit staff. Pay attention to what I say. Result should be a following day. Blah, blah, blah. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh no. This is not going well. I can't run this fucking fast, people. Come on! Oh no. That ain't good. Shit. Oh, that didn't go too well. That probably didn't go too well. Yeah, I need to hire more people. That's horrendous. That was not a good run. Hey Dave, I've got the luckiest news. What, Dr. Wickman? Look, I an analyzed the artifact you brought me in a large amount of an unknown substance was detected. I think it must be iron compressed deep underwater, but it gives off a unique wavelength. I went ahead and developed a radar to track those waves. Mm. Oh, that's why... It, why is that news, Lucky? Oh. Being in coy today, are we? This radar is bound to come in useful on your next expedition. What do you mean, next expedition? Cobra forced me to go along last time. I was given a contract with your name on it. The cancellation charge for breaking the contract is over 20. No. What? When, what were you talking about? Don't be so, so by the book. Check the signal for me and check test out the radar. 
Give it to me. I'll tell you if it works a little more. I owe you some Mexicans to help up. <laughs> right? Highlander? Right? damage with the harpoon gun. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Hey, Andrew Matthews. Yeah, I'll take the harpoon, because that gives me a little bit more capacity in the end. Okay. Sterry Puffer. Oval shaped with a relatively long and thin body. The, the 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 area changed again. Look at that. Let's see what we've got here. Salt. My temples. Popping it through, need to shower. Two out in the UK, sweaty, sweaty. 30 degrees here, mate. It's fucking boiling. Small net gun. Hmm. Seven fish at sa Say less. Say less. Yeah, I need, to, I need to freshen up a little bit before hump day chimba as well because it's fucking roasting here. Okay, so apparently I'm using this net wrong, so I need to try it again. There you go. Zatumbi is here. Get my rifle back. It's not like you to say sorry. I was waiting on a different story. Ow. This time I'm mistaken. Wherever you are, we're breaking in. I don't know why I'm seeing Nickelback right now, but it's probably appropriate. Black and white snapper. Triple shot, baby. Boom. I'll take any fish I can get with me, so I don't have to worry about supplies. Oh, look at that. More stuff. Dang, that harpoon did 10 damage on that f big fucker? Jeez, man. 
Aha. Decent damage, I would say. Oh, my bread and butter. Fucking jellyfish. Freaking jellyfish, my dude. Whoa! Katana! Whoa! Whoa, and it does... Good damage, actually. Oh no. Oh no. 32 oxygen. We got this. Got this. Getting a bit worried there. Ever so slightly. Nah, the katana is actually better. I get rid of them, not like super heavy. Mm, sadly, it's my probably the jellyfish. <sighs> oh boy. Does. Eh, still a bit more, but that's okay. It's negligible at the very least. Gun enhancement kit. Too heavy. Probably have to get rid of the trigger fish, to be honest with you. Or the Wait, no. I'll get rid of the jellyfish actually. Because I think that's what's easing up so much shit for me. Mm. 
Bit unfortunate, but has to be done. Let's get rid of the parrot fish as well. That's a little better. That's a little better. Oxygen, that's good. Okay, I have to. Fuck, there's a shark. That's not good. There's a shark up there. Two oxygen bottles. That's. Lucky. That's very lucky. Mm, I'm reaching the limit of my weight, though. Very considerate what I'm gonna take this time. <clears throat> Orange starfish. Signals coming from inside. If we have some sort of tool, we could move the the rocks aside. Come on up now! What? You fucking kidding me? Oh, uh, thought I heard something. Yeah, you did. You did hear something, Dave. Way too heavy. Yeah, I'm way over over the, the weight limit. I'm going to get out. Uh, my back. Uh, there you go. A little stretch. A dish must be registered on the menu to be served to guests. Try swapping them out. Uh, yeah, every once in a while. Found a place with a signal from Sea People Civilization. I can't hold back my academic thirst. Just check it out. I'm at an important symposium right now. Please talk it over with Copper first. I'll come by tomorrow. Oh. Huh? How do you get rid of the rock piles? You have to use a bomb, of course. <laughs> Is it okay to dead any bombs underwater? Were well, you talking about a rock pile somewhere deep below? I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's put a little trust in the sea regenerative power. He's trying to gloss things over again. But there's an issue. The delivery ships haven't been arriving lately. I need to get a delivery from a bomb expert I know. Hmm. Apparently the ship's gone off the radar. I think it's sunk. If I could use the drone I ordered, we could retrieve the supplies. Dave, could you go into the sea and retrieve drone materials? materials? How am I supposed to find them in the ocean? It's huge! Delivery boxes are likely to have been carried by the ocean's current. Look for a place with ocean currents. That sounds dangerous. Time to upgrade your equipment. Hmm. I don't have enough cash to actually do that. Okay. Well, we shall see, right?
Hey, bent over. How's it going, good sir? Turmeric. How you doing, my friend? How you doing? Hope all is well with Bendova. Yeah, I'm kind of glad I got this for the Nintendo Switch as well, because I'm definitely going to play this a lot more. <laughs> it's actually pretty fun. Trank dot. Doing well, just got back from running around, got bills paid and such. Yeah. The responsibilities of a grown adult, eh? Cheap Japanese sword. Hmm. Jack's favorite. Two oxygen balls. Ooh. That's good, that's good. There's an escape pod, that's good to know. He's dead. That will give me a lot of money. And there's an oxygen tank. Woohoo! Yep, definitely take that.
bullet or He splooched on the screen! How dare he? How dare he do that? It's a good thing there's an escape pod here because I probably need it in a second. Probably should get the fuck out of here because this is like critical deaths. Yeah, I'm um, shit. Okay, I underestimated that. That's not good. Mm. Can only take one item with me. That sucks. Um, I'll probably take the shark with me because that's like. That's the first time I drowned. That sucks. I was close to Nox. This is in the safety part, too. Expecting that so quickly. Let's check out what we have. <laughs> Cooking, serving. Mm -hmm. Kyoko, hiring complete. <laughs> Looks like we have our first staff. <laughs> Higher staff must be placed. <laughs> Seeing the obvious, so things will get tough with our staff help. What customers start coming? It's also training to consider besides hiring this off for now. Yup. some dishes. The terror.
Okay, let's go. I thought that running a restaurant would be so stressful. <laughs> yeah, I haven't been. Haven't, you haven't gone diving yet, have you? What is it this time? I'm thinking of doing some investigations on an important paper. I'm going to need some help. Give me free blue shells and free brown shells. Okay, but aren't you supposed to do this sort of thing yourself? Are you kidding me? Writing a paper requests a ton of research and investigation. What you're doing is only a very tiny part of it all. So don't let it get to your head. Hurry along. I don't have much time until the deadline. You're yeah, really impossible. Since you say it's for, for paper, was it blue shells and brown shells? Yes. Yes, she said that. I forgot to tell you something. What is it, Miss Yoshi? When you hire employees, more employees to purchase more ingredients, you will have to take care of many things all at once. So I decided to give you a management app, which works on a new smartphone. You can check the current situation of Bancho Sushi at any time using it. You can check the status of your restaurant without visiting it. That sounds handy. I don't link the app. Why don't you check it on your smartphone? Bancho Sushi will grow bigger and prosper. Nice. Vody! This game is fun. There's also a DLC for this, I think. Yep, the Gojira uh, DLC. That will uh, unlock after chapter 3. I have to upgrade my equipment. Hmm. I mean, you can't have time for some extra oxygen, that's for sure. Yep. Take another dive! I'm gonna take, go for another 21 23 minutes and then I'm gonna. Take a quick break, and we'll return for the hump day chin wag. I love the bass in that, that song. The bass line's pretty good. I'm 
ingredients is always a good thing. Stabby, stabby, stabby. The fact that I already got more oxygen is helping quite a bit in that situation. Yes. So, nah, I'm good. It's probably a good gun, but not right now. Okay, we got 94 oxygen left. So, not too bad. Fucking. Dickhead. Slooged all over the screen! I really shouldn't push my luck with the death. So I don't want to like drown again. It doesn't help that I'm over encumbered again. See if I can wait a minute. Eight kilograms. Wow. No wonder I'm, I'm so overweight already. Now that's already better. I mentioned two and one more shell. Seems to be an oh! shit. Important ingredient here.
How are you immune to bullets when you cough yourself up? Riddle me that, Batman. <laughs> yeah, you could, we could use that island sometime. Ah, I don't want to dive too deep. Okay, oh piss off. There you go. Ammo is always a good thing. Ammo is always a good thing. Push my luck too hard. Okay. Okay, I got all the parts that I need. Fulfill two quests at once. Pretty good, pretty good. Just need to find an escape pod now. Oh no, there's a fucking shark here, of course. Ugly cat face from the main character's hideous. Yeah, in the Star Wars game, that's true. Daily dysfunction. Hey, how's it going? Boost of sales, early access, then on release day issues, day one patch, deleting all early access game saves. Yep. That game's gonna be a fucking PR nightmare if it will be shit, and I'm all here for it. Ubi Chef's gonna get what they fucking deserve. Too heavy. I can't even carry anything. I'm also convinced that the motion capturing for the chick was done by a dude because she walks like a dude as well. Wouldn't surprise me at the very least. Because modern the modern industry hates women. Imagine that. Some extra oxygen before I from getting out of here. It was made for Han Solo. Nah, you could say that. Not my Han Solo, though. Well, it looks like it at least. I can't say for sure, but. Viking Assassin's created the Hatha as well. Yeah, it did. And Ubisoft insisted that the female protagonist was actually the main character as well, which I thought was pretty funny. Let's return to the surface. Since I'm already like 9 kilograms over. That was harder than I expected. These are hard to find. Oh, this isn't bad. Now then, if I just complete the delivery to Eco Watcher. Ta da! <laughs> Research level gate. Eco Watcher. Oh, you don't know? Eco Watcher is a mission based app made to protect the environment. You get points for completing missions on the app, and you get rewards for re reaching certain levels. So, this was for points on the app, not for a paper? Well, uh, you could say that uh, they're basically the same thing. Try it out too, if you're interested. See ya! <gasps> okay, all ready for Chinwag. Windows open, ready to go. Videos updated. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up here soon, so we can I get some coffee in me. Should be done by tomorrow morning. What about you, this? 500 gold! Fuck yeah! 500 gold.
gonna send that to the restaurant. Perfect. Eco Watcher. Mm. Aha. Can do more research. Level two. Equal health bracelet. Uh -huh. Equal poison resist bracelet. Okay. Let's grab the diving suit. Close that one out. Save the game real quick. Okay. I think I'll be calling it here now, actually, since. Although, you know what? Let's, let's take one night dive in one restaurant, then. So we should be fine. Let's see. Equipment. Let's take one more dive. Finish up the day. Might as well. Now get ready for home day. They cannot collect the sea urchin just yet. I love how relaxing this game is. Kill fish, they said. It would be easy, they said. <laughs> yes, yeah, these games are like you play and you figure out if it time and it's four hours later. Yep, that's pretty much how it boils, it boils down to. I've been playing for almost three hours and I feel like uh, no time has passed for some reason. You know what the funny thing is? I'm playing a fat bloke and I'm not even offended by it. like scorpion just then from Mortal Kombat. Ah, you fucking prick. Die! Die! That fucking barracuda took a lot of life off of me. It's not good. Okay. 
could actually take the net gun. It's actually a good idea. Let's do that. Pretty insane. But that's the thing, if you have an addicting gameplay loop and it keeps you busy, it's just what happens. Boxing gloves. What? Okay. I got way too much stuff on me again. Mm. Should probably get rid of the barracuda again. It's a little better. Oh, shit. I don't have an escape bar nearby, do I? I have to swim slowly so I don't waste my oxygen. No, I... No, of course I'm being attacked by a fucking fish now. Fuck! Ah! Oh, that's annoying. That's annoying. Um, Let's take the... Valley. Oh well, happens. It happens. Got a little too greedy. Let's wrap up the day at the restaurant. Cheers, that's good. Menu, okay. Uh.
I always love the look of terror on the fish's face. Space Marine 2 is soon, it's going to be um, awesome. Yep. We'll be good. <clears throat> 280 net profit. Nice. Look at that. I'm getting there. I'm slowly getting there. Good morning. Sorry I couldn't come by yesterday because of the symposium. Did I speak with Cobra? Uh, come to think of it, I got materials since Cobra said he was repairing your drone yesterday. Oh, a bit later, aren't I? <laughs> I repaired the drone just fine, thanks to you. I got some supplies as well. Here's the bombs you ask for. Also... Oh, thank you, Dr. Baker. Baker. Please do. Alright, let's head back to that rock pile. Oh, wait. Uh, I haven't finished... Starting today, the Cobra shop is officially open. Uh, what? What is that? Deliveries have stopped, but if the drone in working order, I can transport three types of items in a day. Talk to me and select the Cobra shop to see a list that changes every day. I'll buy some stuff that you don't need so, to so, check off the sale tab as well. Haha, -ha, I won't change high price, charge high prices just because I've got only business here. So don't be afraid to visit often. I feel like you let your business tactics slip just now. <laughs> In any case, it's time to take it back to the rock pile. Where the signal from the sea people was detected. Cobra shop. Underwater's a camera. Ooh. 
That's right. Uh, it will be important for research to re re record importance in data uh, fortress. Take the camera and let, I'll let you know when I find the right place to use it. Okay. Health brace there with the eco watch a little made them of environmental friendly materials. It reduces damage taken by 10%. Oh, that's good. I like that. King, baby. <laughs> Silver quite nice. quick such more food Gold. Right, let's do interior. There you go. Yeah. 
give it a bit more flair. I like that. Former Slayer here ch changed to Tyranitar. Hey, how's it going? Good to see you, dude. quick pick up there's some other time okay let's wrap it up here and call it it's been a good f f over three hours so it's good actually enjoyed the game quite a lot believe it or not right, let me go full face real quick all right thank you guys indeed for watching um uh, like concurrent viewers thank you very much indeed for that i'll uh be back in about 20 well 19 minutes from now so we will be uh on the hump day chinwag is going to be co-hosted on my channel of course also go over to tommy if you can because he's going to be uh Hosting the main show, of course. And if you want to want to support the channel, like share and subscribe and all that fun stuff. And do consider checking out gaming with Smoo as well. Of course. Let me send you guys over to uh, who's on line right now. Hill versus Babyface. Nah, Station Abum. You know what? I'll send you guys over to Tombi because we're gonna be on on the show in a moment let's go to check out hunt day chinwag episode 18 there you go all right i'll see you guys there in a bit have a good one you take care of yourselves if i don't see you anymore bye for now adios